new video tonight showing a group of what appear to be teenage boys storming a 7-Eleven in Little Italy and stealing everything they can get their hands on. There was also one more incident caught on video on International Skate Day showing skateboarders involved in violence and theft. Tonight, people in San Diego want to know why this is happening and who will stop things like this from happening. CBS 8's Anna Laurel is in Balboa Park where someone was beaten by a crowd of skateboarders. I'm here at the iconic fountain in Balboa Park, just outside the Fleet Science Center for kids. Now, when that fight broke out Wednesday, families and children were out here. So were more than 100 skateboarders. I just felt like something exciting was happening. They were cheering each other on. It got out of hand real quick. William Dorsett is a spray paint artist setting up in Balboa Park late Wednesday afternoon when he heard a commotion and started filming. His daughter Kat was at the park with him. She says she actually went into the mob and saw two people at the center of a fight. And I see two guys, the adult and the minor, headlocking each other with their ankles. The adult grabs the kid by the ankle and just doesn't let go. All of his other friends pull him by the hair or the adult by the hair and then he's still not letting go so they start punching him, kicking his face. Like it was it was a lot. Several minutes into William's video, you see this person on the ground. He did get hit in the face quite a bit, and he falls to his ground, the ground and smacks his head and goes unconscious for a few minutes. They both say Balboa Park Rangers were watching, but did nothing. They waited they until he fell. It before it got that bad, and no one, no one did that has the authority to, you know. It's 2023, boys. Good. This is video a man in Little Italy posted to Nextdoor. A group of skateboarders run into his neighborhood 7-Eleven, grab everything they can, and take off. This happened Wednesday afternoon, the same day as the Balboa Park fight. It was the Go Skate Day, and they, the, last year they had cops that would, you know, follow them around and stick with them just like you would a protest because that's essentially what it is. This year, the man hurt in the park had no one until he was down and rangers called police. William did get him screaming to the crowd as he lie on the ground. Go away! Leave me alone! Balboa Park says its rangers are not law enforcement and they are not armed. I reached out to San Diego police. They are investigating and we hope to have more next week. In Balboa Park, this is Anna Laurel for CBS 8.